Peggy 16 By themselves, people are such frail things. That is why, in times of calamity, they pray for a shepherd to save them. The era later known as the Age of Chaos gave birth to a new shepherd. This is his story. This is really it! This is our world! It was in the Celestial Record. The legend says the Lady of the Lake guards the Sacred Blade, and the one who draws it becomes the Shepherd, right? You didn't even know who I was, and you helped me without asking anything in return. I see! This is you! Brotherhood between men! So what are you asking me to do? Stand around behind you and twiddle my thumbs? From now on, I'm fighting too. I must find a way to make that happen to bring humans and Seraphim together again, as it was in the days of yore. Saray, you really can see Seraphim, can't you? Yes, I touched on it before, but now I must clarify to you the true purpose of the Shepherd. What the Shepherd must quell is the source of all malevolence, the being who gives rise to the Hellions. The Lord of Calamity. This whole riot was a setup. I can't believe they'd involve the citizens they swore to protect in a power struggle. Do not be hasty! To become my sword is to serve as a vessel for me to dwell in and to assume the Shepherd's burden. If purifying the Hellions will save both humans and Seraphim, then it's the best chance I'll ever have to make that dream a reality. That's why I shall become the Shepherd. I offer myself to you as your vessel. I shall bear your burden! I've waited long for this moment. I want you to travel the world and discover all sorts of things. The answers you seek are those you must discover for yourself. I didn't come along just to be a liability for you. Miklia. Get over yourself. Do you really think this is your dream alone? I understand. This is our dream. 